you can are. even some of them you don't even remember who they no. are. No. Yep. All right, on the BuzzFeed this morning, the editors uh, there reveal that they think are the 11 most cringe-worthy makeovers in celeb culture. Take a look. Oh, I can't wait. I know, me too. Okay, Aww, Carrie Russell. Oh, Carrie Russell. Yeah, they were, the producers were so mad when she cut her Remember hair. Remember that? Remember? Yeah. Uh, Karate Kid 1 and the remake with Will Smith. I don't think it was terrible. Oh, <laughs> Carrot Top and any, oh. What happens with comedians that want to work? Oh, here's the Kenny Rogers we always oh. talk about. <laughs> Oh, boy, that picture. Oh, did. see, now that's, that wasn't a makeover. That was that a was meltdown. A, that was a meltdown, right. Oh, Linz. Linz. Mm. Mm. Lindsay Lohan, she used to be really, I mean, she still is a pretty woman. Mm -hmm. but. Oh, no, that's not a makeover. That's a remake. That's a re redo, yeah. Yeah. Aww. Mm -hmm. Aww. That's it's, just sad. In that other Michael Jackson story, we're hearing more about him in his final days, too. That one's really unfortunate. That, right. who, 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 who is that? That was, what's her name? Okay. Again, with the pseudo-famous. Oh, yeah, the Wonder Woman makeover. M much better before. Who's that? Is that Liv Tyler? No. Is it? I don't know. That looks like the oh, phone girl. commercial girl. Oh, it was from Catherine Zeta-Jones uh. to the new, younger Catherine Zeta-Jones? No, I think uh. that's a phone commercial. But she did T-Mobile, right? And then T-Mobile <laughs> girl. Yeah, see? All right. Oh. Okay. Um, getting back to the carrot top photo, oh. what I was going to say is, what happens to these comedians that decide they'd rather lift weights, like Joe Piscopo, than yeah, be funny? Yeah, remember that? Yeah. That was too bad, because I thought he was genuinely he was funny. funny. He was funny, yeah. in Saturday Night Live, and... Yeah. But he gets a lot of bad ra uh, rap right. from that. Carrot top, not so much. That uh, Michael Jackson picture just reminded me of this quote oh. from this Matt Fittis, who was the, the martial arts bodyguard who's, mm -hmm. who's speaking out. But he said that uh, Jackson was an anorexic drug addict, covered with needle marks mm. and bald. And oh, he's losing his days. hair because of the drugs. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's so too bad. Sad. Yeah. Oh, that was a sad picture. It's a whole different image of him that you get. So remember the story at the top of the show? We were talking about uh, stay-at-home moms and how much they're worth, 113000 a year. Mm -hmm. I posted that on our Facebook, uh, on Bowl of Bacon, and you replied. We'll have that coming up. Fox tonight. All new Glee's got rebellious teens and audition drama. And Black Sue and Original Recipe Sue are gonna take care of it. Then all new New Girls on the Rebound. He is the all time worst crier. <laughs> and he's making Jess the other woman. Now I know how Monica Lewinsky feels. Hey man, you feel like Monica Lewinsky. New Girl. Tonight, starting at 8. On the next all new Wendy. From Nip Tuck and Unforgettable, the smoking hot Dylan Walsh. Today at noon on Fox 2. I was hurt in that auto accident. At first, I didn't want to hire a lawyer. My sister said, look, don't trust the insurance company. Call Lee. Best advice I got. Lee got me $820,000. 1-800-LEE-FREE. Whether you come to Beaumont for a simple screening or major surgery, you'll find the most advanced medical care in the world. Precise imaging for even earlier detection. Leading-edge technology that turns major surgery into minimally invasive procedures and research that's leading to medical breakthroughs and new hope. So when you're choosing a hospital, why in the world would you go anywhere else? Mother Waddles has been helping the poor and needy in our community for over 50 years. Now you can do your part to help Mother Waddles to help those in need. Donate your car to Mother Waddles and receive the Blue Book value for your car as a tax deduction. Your car donation will be used to provide food, clothing, and shelter to those less fortunate. So call the Mother Waddles car donation program today at 313 Waddles and get the Blue Book value for your car donation. Or simply go to MotherWaddles.org to donate your car today. At Medical Weight Loss, it's a shape of things to come. The best part about the new me is I enjoy going shopping. After losing 70 pounds, I can shop anywhere now. I love all the choices I have now when I go shopping for clothes. I'm Sylvia. I lost 50 pounds with Medical Weight Loss Clinic. I'm Cheryl, and I've lost over 70 pounds with the help of Medical Weight Loss Clinic. For a limited time, join a weight loss program for $3 per week. Call 1-800-GET-SLIM for details. I was hit head-on by a drunk driver, and I didn't know who to turn to. My good friend said I should call Lee, and it was the best advice I got. Lee's a winner. He got me $400,000. 1-800-LEE-FREE. Oh, there it is. Early to bed. Love 
watch that show. And in between, between I cooked oh. and cleaned and went out of my head. Do you remember the name of the original movie that was that series was spawned from? No, I didn't even know there was a spawning. With Ellen, what was her name? Oh, uh, Ellen Burstyn. Yes. Alice doesn't live here anymore. Oh, I really? Crank it up. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yes. welcome back to the Armada Room at the Holiday Inn Holiday. <laughs> oh, this is a good uh, TV, what do we call it, theme song? Yes. Yes. Oh, Wait, by the time they get done with the song, what time is left for the show? Was it Mel's Diner, Mel? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, family Guy made fun of that with the, and then there's Maud, because Maud's theme goes on for like two and a half minutes. Right, right. And then there's Maud. Right. And then there's Maud. Bowl of bacon, uh, stay-at-home mom worth $113,000 a year in all of her different jobs combined. Cook, psychologist, janitor, daycare provider. Peacekeeper. You know, all that stuff. We ask you what you thought of that. and Law enforcer. Oh, right. Um, well, let's see. Taxi Denise driver. says, by the way, I've done both. I'd much prefer to stay home. Okay. And uh, Ashley says, I'm a stay-at-home mom, but would definitely like to be working also. Stay, Staying at home isn't... Um, isn't isn't moving us into our house. Oh, I see. So you need the extra cash to help you move in. Pamela says, I can honestly say I do way more work as a stay-at-home mom than I ever did as a working one. At least when I was a working mom, I got a break. Mary, very <laughs> true indeed. I have been on both sides of the fence. Keep in mind that many working moms have to then go home and still do all of those things, or dads. They just have to condense and reduce some of those things. But the 24-7 thing is still there. It's a huge job either side of the fence. Uh, Jeff Goulet says, I love when science gives us numbers to prove crap we've known for a thousand <laughs> years. Stay at home's at home mom's rule. Yeah, yeah thank you, Jeff. This lady, this Jessie says she's homeschooling four kids. Oh my gosh. So she should add at least 30 grand to her total. <laughs> probably right. Um, Mike and Michonne says, Jason, Bacon Fest, June 2nd. <laughs> <laughs> a little off topic, that's okay. Right. Off, off topic. Right. All right, well, you know, uh, lots of good feedback here on the Facebook page. And it's time to announce the winner of Fox 2 Exposed. It's Jeanette Gregory of Riverview. You're the winner, Jeanette. So can I just say, I went in to get some food from El Nobel Nook because I had to run back in here and get a, um, yes. uh, to do a segment. It's almost gone, so thank you to the newsroom vultures for taking <laughs> everything. Appreciate it. Oh, oh, Is this all that was left? One little nibble nook? By the way, I'm... I'm a little nibble from the nook? Mm -hmm. Well, of course, it's good food. That's why they're That's in right. there. I mean, great stuff. I love Thanks, the Thanks, everyone, nook. for... And National listen, Honesty if, Day was if yesterday. If there's anybody yeah. in this uh, building who needs to eat something, <laughs> it's our Cam Carmen. This is my favorite restaurant. Save the Never food mind for that. Cam. Okay, the Upper Peninsula as the 51st state. What about Puerto Rico? Well, I know. Well, we'll examine the possibilities. What's that moose doing? Moose is a techno move. In a city where the news never stops, neither do we. Fox 2 News, working for you. If you have lung cancer or mesothelioma from working around asbestos, call Zamler, Mellon & Schiffman, the Michigan law firm representing asbestos victims. Call 1-800-LAWYERS. With a two-year-old at home. I have two daughters. We have five boys and a large family. I couldn't imagine not having AT&T verse. I, I, it just would not work for our household. Like if we're watching a movie in mom's room and mom doesn't want us in our room, so we just go in the living room and continue watching it. Call to get AT&T verse for $29 a month for six months with a total home DVR included. Plus get HBO and Cinemax free for three months. If I need to pause something, as it happens. Diaper. He can start screaming, I can stop the show, and then pick it up on a different TV somewhere else in the house. We can record Sesame Street for her, boring sports for him, and for me, the real housewives of anything. So call now to get AT&T U-verse TV for only $29 a month for six months with a total home DVR included. Plus get HBO and Cinemax free for three months. And ask about next day installation at no extra charge. Without U-verse, I think we'd be just a big mess. Injured in a car accident? Any lawyer can get you money. A smart lawyer can get you more. I was in a terrible car accident, and Mike came through for me. We have 30 smart lawyers who specialize in auto, truck, and motorcycle accident cases. The Mike Morris team has always been there for me. I was in an auto accident, and I called Mike. He won $360,000 for me. Call and talk to a smart lawyer right now. The advice is free. 
855-MIKE-WINS. WJBK Fox 2's public file contains quarterly reports listing children's educational and informational programs and DTV consumer education reports. These files are available for public review during regular business hours at 16550 West Nine Mile, Southfield, Michigan. DTV consumer education reports are also available on myfoxdetroit.com. Call Zamler, Mellon, and Schiffman, the Michigan lawyers representing Michigan people for Social Security Disability. If you've been denied your Social Security Disability, call 1-800-LAWYERS. The call is free. The advice is free. Tell me quick, ain't love a kick in the head. Welcome to the back nine. Here's what's coming up this hour. Yeah, she was, um, she got the biggest part in this movie, the five-year engagement, of any Michigan talent. And she is as cute as can be. Her name is Zoe Nimkowitz. We'll talk about, uh, we're going to talk to Zoe. I think we're going to talk to her mom, too. Um, so it's just kind of on a whim, went in and auditioned, got a big role in this movie. Uh, and look at how cute she is. <laughs> so we'll talk about this new, her newfound uh, celebrity life. Right. And Inside the Script, that's the title, Inside the Script, with Fraser Heston, uh, Charlton Heston's kid, is going to talk to us about that. Ooh, you almost got scum, kid. Did you see, you see that? Yes, I did. Uh, and I don't have Soap Pike's picture out here. I need to go get him. Right. What do the lives of a few Jews mean? You know, it's funny, as, as my dad gets older, he looks like Charlton Heston. Think so? A lot. All the old men kind of kind of do take off like the Charles same <laughs> jowly and the hair and, and the butt goes away. And right. It all, yeah. Stop it. You got some time. We have a need to know recall this morning for puppy owners. Diamond Pet Foods is voluntarily recalling its Diamond Puppy Formula, and Alan is here to tell us about that. All right, thank you, Cam. You talked about Diamond Pet Foods is voluntarily recalling its Diamond Puppy Formula. Now, there are concerns that the dry dog food could be contaminated with salmonella. The products were made at a plant in South Carolina where production was suspended on April 8th. It's the same plant that made mold-contaminated food that killed dozens of dogs nationwide in 2005. Michigan is one of 12 states affected by the recall. And sales are up at Chrysler, so much so that there will be no summer shutdown at the automaker's Jefferson North Assembly Plant. Workers will continue to produce the Jeep, Jeep Grand Cherokee and Dodge Durango straight through the customary two-week summer shutdown in early July. Chrysler's first quarter sales were up 39 percent over last year's numbers. Workers at the Jefferson North plant have been working overtime two out of every three Saturdays. The plant will be adding a third shift to its production sometime next year. And five years after the housing crash, it looks like the market is still far from recovery. Homeownership is at its lowest point in 15 years. New figures released by the Census Bureau show the rate of U.S. homeownership fell in the first three months of this year to 65 percent. That's down from 66 percent in the first quarter of last year. Last time the rate hit 65 percent was in the first quarter of 1997. And now back to the Big Brown Couch. And here I sit with Dina and our friend Soap Pike Scum Cake. Now how did those two words come to um, um, because come together? Soap Pike was supposed to be spoke Oh. And scum cake was supposed to be a shoemaker. Yes. Oh. And we got burned in the teleprompter one day and they just blossomed. From and there. you said scum cake? <laughs> so now it's scum cakery. Scum, scum cakery is a verb, as in. What's got? Okay. Um, just wondering. What uh, what you said? So yeah, so so Pike uh, it was Lee, and then uh, it was some guy named uh, Shoemaker, and, uh, okay. and Jason got burned. We scum were cake. Scum cake. Scum scum cakery. <laughs> we still have to come up with a, a uh, you know rubber 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 you know, like yeah, whenever we like show them we have to have a sound effect for yeah, it. So yeah yeah. So more and more women are in the workforce according to the 2010 census numbers, and of households where both husbands and wives work, 32 percent of men took care. <laughs> <laughs> Another case of scum cakery <laughs> took R of the kids at least once a week. And 20% of dads were the primary caretakers of children under five. These numbers show more women are going to work and more men are out of work. That's it. Boy, times are changing because you think about, you know, when we were raised and your dad's mm. roles in your lives. and Absolutely. They were the ones who went to work. They came home. Dinner was on the table. Right. And, you know, there's not a lot of diaper changing. And, no. Um, 
not a lot of interaction with the kids. Right, cooking in the kitchen. Nope. So nope. Yeah, we're all becoming more well-rounded. Yes, we are. And well-rounded. <laughs> and well-rounded. <laughs> in more ways than one. America's 51st state may be just a car trip away. The Marquette County Board of Commissioners is considering a plan to make the Upper Peninsula its own separate state. So many people living in the UP are upset with all the money they send to Lansing compared to the money sent back to them. They've been down this road before. In, in 1975, they tried to pass a bill creating a new state. It failed by a single vote. I can't believe they didn't demand a recount. Hmm. If they succeed hmm. this time, the new state would be called Superior. So I'm, I'm not... I don't claim to be an expert on matters like this, but I mean, they can vote themselves into statehood, or does, does it? Does the no, I think there's going to be. I thought Washington that, yeah, has to approve. Somebody's <laughs> got to sign off on that. Right? The federal government I is be like, a state. Okay. wait a second, because they did the same thing in the Florida Keys, the Conquer Republic. Mm -hmm. They declared their independence like 25 years ago. Um, Yet it's still not officially. Yeah. Let's Apparently, see. they're going to ask uh, Northern Michigan University to conduct maybe a. Uh, you know, a, a study. Exploratory. Exploratory study, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. Because yeah, Lake State is too busy talking about the words and phrases that are out this year. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that that Lake, Lake Superior State, aren't they like, the ones right. that do the, the annual list of phrases and words that right. are done? Amazing. When they're done with that, they're going to look yeah. at the feasibility <laughs> of uh, the UP other becoming its own do. state. Well, you know, Tom Jones, he admits, admits, he turned down an iconic movie role. What is it? People say. <laughs> I'll tell you what. I, I, don't, I don't know, I don't I know about that. I agree. I have a hard time believing this one. Right. And it's Techno Tuesday. We want to say thank you to our guest this morning. Yeah, we've been livening it up there in the studio. Got the turntables going. One and Jones. Two, right? Little bit of everything. You're injured, and it may seem easiest just to sign whatever the insurance company puts in front of you. Don't let the insurance company take advantage of your situation. Call 1-800-WIN-WIN-1, the law offices of Goodman Acker, right now. Now is the time to take advantage of a great offer from Xfinity, only from Comcast. Right now, you can get Xfinity TV for just $10 a month for 12 months. Call 1-877-557-7469 today. Get local programming in the top networks like CBS, NBC, ABC, and Fox so you can watch hit shows like 30 Rock and The Office for one low price. Call 1-877-557-7469 and get Xfinity TV starting as low as $10 a month for 12 months. Or step up to a digital TV package and get access to Xfinity On Demand with the most on-demand choices on TV and streaming online. Plus, start an on-demand show in one room and finish it in another. And Xfinity offers tons of HD movies and shows and premium channels like HBO and Showtime. So don't wait. Get started with Xfinity TV for as low as $10 a month for 12 months. Or step up to a digital TV package today. Call 1-877-557-7469 now. It ends Tuesday. Wallside's best factory direct deal, two for one. Order two wallside windows, only pay for one. Order six, only pay for three. You can order a house full of 12 windows and only pay for six. Plus five years, no interest, no down payment. Make your home more livable and more energy efficient. But call before Tuesday, May 8th at midnight for wallside windows at two for one. Call 1-800-521-7800. Call a law firm that won't let some big insurance company take advantage of you with a quick dollar offer. Don't accept less than everything you deserve. Call 1-800-WIN-WIN-1, the law offices of Goodman Acker, right now. When we heard church people say, we are in the holy way, there are strange things happening. All right, how about a classic clip? Jones, Tom Jones. The sexy singer says he was almost, almost offered the role of James Bond, but he says the producers decided he was too famous to play the super spy. Really? They felt people <laughs> wouldn't believe it. Maloney. <laughs> right. <laughs> Jones does have a Bond connection anyway, though. He wrote the title song to the 1965's Thunderball. You weren't even born yet. Neither of you. Mm -mm. No. Nope. Jones is currently
currently working as a judge on the British version of The X Factor. So he's saying um, before Sean Connery, it was either Sean Connery no, 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 or Tom uh, Jones? I think he's saying that he would have re replaced Sean Connery. Uh, well, actually, that was George Lazenby that, that, that replaced Connery. And then Connery came back, and then it was Roger, Roger Moore. Moore. So I'm thinking that they probably would have offered it to him around this time of Lazenby or Roger Moore. But he, okay. ha he has um, how much acting experience, Tom Jones? Right. Did he, he was ever? in uh, Mars Attacks, the Tim Burton movie. <laughs> Well, there you go. Well, say, say no, no more. more. Listen, I had a pint with Tom Jones when I was in London. He's a cool guy, oh, and I happen to really like him a lot. You have a man crush on him, don't you? Oh, I think he's the best. I think he's great. He was more my mom's generation. Yeah, I, I, I I never got. I wouldn't know him if he walked into this room. The sexy really? factor. Mm -hmm. Never, never I, understood that whole women throwing their panties at him. Yeah, what was that? Can you explain that? Did you guys talk about that? Uh, no, we didn't. We didn't go there. That seemed a little obvious as a conversation topic. I don't remember. Right, what I'm sure. About. How many times it has been asked? Maybe we need to see an older picture of him from back in like 19. Right. 60. 60. Yeah, we hate. Yeah. He was the he was the man back in like the late 60s, Why? early 70s. Why? But still, could he have been Bond? He couldn't. I I don't. Yeah, he didn't have an but acting the, the career until. Funny thing about Tom Jones is maybe we can call up a clip and get it in before the end of the show. Back in the day when he was at his the height of his powers, he only had one move on stage. It was. Exactly. It was sort of an Elvis <laughs> knockoff way of moving, and that's all he did. He would sing, and then he'd he'd go like this, and then he'd sing, and then and he'd the go like this. And the chicks went crazy. Not my, not Give me a dad. young Elvis any day over right. that. I agree. I agree. A big announcement to Murray, and, and Murray's here to tell us about that. Hi. Hey, guys, it's not unusual. <laughs> it, no, it isn't. To be loved Tom by Jones, love. Tom Jones. It's, it's, it's a, hit, it's a hidden like message him, in that. Man. Yeah, hey, big announcement you're talking about. It's coming up in the job shop in just a couple of moments. Major U.S. company with a huge Michigan presence looking for workers, especially Michigan veterans. They're going to be with me when we open up the Fox 2 job shop right after this brief timeout. is happening on New Girl. Intrigue. Mama like. Nick moves forward. You want to move in together? We lost them. We sure did, Captain Black Sparrow. And Jess backslides big time. Such an ugly crier. It's like he's a slow motion sneeze. <laughs> New Girl, tonight at 9 on Fox 2. Next Extra, Mario's breaking J-Lo's giant news. Right here only on Extra. What's her worldwide announcement? Next Extra, tonight at 7.30 on Fox 2. Have you applied for Social Security benefits and been denied? Make the right call. 1-800-LEE-FREE. You could get approved and start collecting your checks now. If you've been denied benefits, make the right call and you could get approved. Call Lee Free. How do you measure quality of life? When you're disabled, a lot can depend on how long it takes to get approved for your disability benefits. For most people, it can take months or even years. We'll work hard to get the benefits you deserve as soon as possible. Call the Cochran Firm today at 1-800-THE-FIRM. Mom? Hmm? What does your esophagus look like? Uh, we're kind of in a hurry. Let's look it up after school. Here. Thanks, Anita. Get the speed to answer life's most pressing questions. Ooh. Call AT&T today to get high-speed internet for the unbelievably low price of just $14.95 a month for 12 months with a one-year price guarantee. Plus, get on-the-go access to the entire national AT&T Wi-Fi hotspot network at no extra charge. Dad, how did Luke Cage get his powers? Uh, uh, Here, I'll show you. Luke Cage's superhuman powers were an unintended side effect. Thanks, Anita. Call AT&T today to get high-speed internet for the unbelievably low price of just $14.95 a month for 12 months with a one-year price guarantee. It's the fastest internet for the price. So call today. Mom, how is paper recycled? Anita. Anita. Answer life's most pressing questions instantly. AT&T. It's not fair. You applied for your Social Security benefits but got denied. Lee could get you approved and you could start collecting your checks now. If you've been denied, make the right call. 1-800-LEE-FREE and you could get approved. Call Lee Free.
you for the introduction, Nick Jagger. Open it up the Fox 2 job shop with AT&T and plenty of jobs open. They're looking specifically for veterans. With me today is Greg Clark, Regional Vice President and Executive Director of External Affairs at AT&T. Thank you for being here. And also David Ritter, who has been with the company since its Ameritech days back in 96. And when you started, you were Air Force Captain David Ritter. That's correct, Murray, yes. That was a long time ago, but you were recruited in the veterans program. I was. Ameritech started uh, recruiting available managers from the military officers and specifically targeted us uh, for our skills and for our uh, commitment to duty and uh, our technical background. So it was a good match of what we did in the military and applying it to jobs at AT&T. Very quickly, your job right now with AT&T I'm a project manager in information technology systems. Okay. What, tell me about AT&T's efforts for veterans especially. Why well, is know, that so important? And thanks for having us, Murray. We think veterans are the leaders of tomorrow. And in response to today's employment opportunities, unemployment crisis that we have in our country, we at AT&T have created a military talent hiring organization specifically to attract veterans to our company. We think they bring leadership, uh, teamwork, which is hugely important, and significant technical capabilities that, that map well into a company like AT&T, sales, finance, marketing, procurement, IT, legal, all those skills that people like David come from the military with really fit well in a company like ours. You talk about the unemployment problem in the country and in Michigan. I want to show you some numbers here because they are staggering. We've used them before about a month ago on the air, but it, in this conversation, you got to see them again. Veterans here in Michigan have had the worst time finding work. Take a look at this. Jobless veterans from from the 9-11 era. The jobless rate is 30% in Michigan for these people. It's 11.5% for the U.S. Michigan tops the list. 11.5% is way too high, but we're like three times the national, the national rate. David, I've seen studies that show how veterans have a culture that really fits in the business world today. Absolutely right, Murray. Well, we have also uh, within AT&T, we have a group of AT&T veterans who support veterans' causes, and not only just for folks who are in active duty, but bringing people in out of the military, uh, translating those skills and uh, what they have to bring to jobs at AT&T. David, let's take a look at some of the jobs right now and write them on the screen, some of the jobs that are open today throughout the company. And we also have specific Michigan jobs on our website. More about that coming up. But first of all, you're looking for engineering, you're looking for maintenance people, telecommunications, salespeople. Uh, as we advance that, you're also looking for project management people, U-verse technicians, financial analysts, marketing, the whole spectrum there. What's going on at AT&T that would dictate this kind of hiring right now? Well, you know, one of the things that we do, um, uh, being in the, uh, the industry that we're in, the mobile internet has really taken over. It's really creating a new economy for the country. And as the, the internet economy creates jobs, we want the military vets to take part in that explosion, in, a, in that job growth. And how many people are you hiring right now? I mean, is there a, a ballpark figure? That well, you last year, I don't have a specific number, but last year we participated in over 50 military-focused career fairs all across the country. We focus on working with military transition offices, uh, locally with military alumni groups, uh, because we really think that the vets uh, are uh, significantly, uh, can really fit in well at our company. The other thing that we do, Murray, is that um, if you are a veteran and you work for AT&T and you get deployed back in the military, if your military pay is less than what you made at AT&T, AT&T is one of the companies that will make up that pay difference for you and your family while you're deployed. Okay. Uh, a couple of things here. First of all, men and women. Correct. to apply mm -hmm. and also uh, these jobs are open to anybody but you're specifically you have a specific program to try to get veterans back to work yes we do and our recruiters uh, we spend a lot of time training our job recruiters so that when they uh, work with um, uh, veterans uh, in the interview process they understand and they can translate military jargon to skills that map into AT&T really well we call it our AT&T careers for vets program where we match people like David uh, with prospective job seekers who are vets veterans and help try to get them matched together so that the military veteran can find jobs that match the skills that they learned in the military with a job that fits their career goals at at and And Greg, as we see with David, it could be a career opportunity right. for you out there or somebody you know. Much more information, a link to all of these jobs and a link to apply at MyFoxDetroit.com. You'll find it right up there in the job shop when you get to that page. Thank you so much for being with us. Good luck to you both. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. All right. See you tonight on Fox 2 News beginning at 5 o'clock. Yo, Dina. Hey, Murray. She is the youngest actress in the five-year engagement. We are going to meet Zoe Nimkowitz, 
And this little Metro Detroit girl wowed them on the red carpet. We're gonna talk about how she landed this role and what's next. At the Sam Bernstein Law Firm, we make it easy from start to finish. That's the Bernstein Advantage. Let our clients tell you how easy it is to get the Bernstein Advantage. A couple days after the accident, you know, I figured I was going to have problems and I called the Bernstein Law Firm. They were very 